Okay. Yeah, let's say the Chiddush today, and at the day we start to share, will be a big miracle in the yeshiva today. Big miracle. What this Musa Shmuel today, Bezat Hashem, will be a big miracle for everyone in the yeshiva who change, make himself a clean, and Bezat Hashem, you will see a big miracle. The foundation is, listen when I talk, don't do nothing else, listen. I see people do other things, this and that, they're not listening, and they, when I don't listen, they don't hear what I say. They don't listen, it's like I'm throwing my diamond to the raw floor. So listen. The essence of a person, you have when he's born, every person when he's born, the essence of a person when a person is born, and you have the essence of a person that he makes himself. You have to take yourself and make yourself. I, so listen, I, a person is born like a mule. What? Mule, mule, I, I. Like a horse, like a parrot. A parrot means. A parrot. A person is born like a mule, and other people, he has to make himself a new person. Other people, you have to make yourself new. I, Pere, other people, you have to make yourself a new creation, a new person. Why? There's the person. Why? Listen, why? No, no, no. I ask you. I'll answer you. I'll answer you. But he's burning it though. Wait a second. Listen. Listen. I don't see any question up here. Uh, listen, 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 listen what I said. What is the new creation of Ben Hashem? We have to make ourselves. When you're born, you take a child, every child in all the universe. Or you make, or you don't change yourself. You still stay a child. Your natural thing is only you want yourself. The natural is me, and everything goes into the mind. What is the best for me? You take yourself in the corner, and everything what comes out is me, me. What is for me? What is for me? This is a mule. It's not other me volet. The new creation that you have to make yourself, all the people in the new creation is, listen carefully, for others, for the other person. Not, not for yourself, for others. And yourself is for others. You need for yourself because you're not healthy, and you don't take care of yourself, and you don't eat, you don't learn, you're not able to help others. But the goal is others, and you have to live for others. It changes the attitude. A person is when he's born by natural way, he's born like a mule that only thinks only by himself. What I can gain, what is for me? Me and me and me and me and me and me. This is without working on yourself. And me and me and me. And me, and me. Like my father said, I say, the word me is the most word to say in the world. No. <laughs> Take the me out. Take the me out. Uh, exactly. Now. Me, myself. Me, and me. Now. The Hiddush is. But listen, the Hiddush. The Hiddush is this me. Yeah, this is like a mule. You have to make yourself a new person. Like a girl, like a converted, like a person. What is your new, new? All that before every person, what is new? Yourself is for others. Live for others. What is getting married? Making a decision. 
I'm living to give to my wife. Others. I'm living to give to the children. Others. I'm living to give to the yeshiva. I'm living to give to Israel. I'm living to help the world. This is the Adu person. When you make that decision, not me, me, you change that and you be this, you're ready to get married. Then you start to get married. When, you don't, when you're old and only me, me, you can be 90 years old, 100 years old, you didn't change. You're still me, me, and you know, she doesn't give your shit because you didn't make that decision. Yet they make that decision from the me out, and me is for others. Others. I have to have me. It may not need meaning. If I don't have myself, I want to turn. But you're, you're living for others. You're living to give for your wife. You're living for your children. You're living for what? Cloudy soul. You're living to, to give the world. To give for the time. But you're living that way. It's a different way. This change. Other people live. You have to accept like a new person. Now, the Hiddush is of this Sabbath Mikalim is when it comes to be for others is you have to be a leader a leader for others and you have to show people the way again you have to be a leader to teach people to be a leader in the Jewish nation How much you said? 50. For me? Yeah. And for you? No, mine is different. Okay, okay. For me, again, the for the to again. Leader. 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 You have to be a leader. Everyone in the Shiva here. Everyone. If you learn in the ask me Shiva. You have obligation to be a leader in Jewish nation. And you have to show people the right way. Your wife, your children, Cloud Israel, everybody. Don't be stuck with yourself to 120. This is not the way of the Torah. This is the Samaritan kind of this piece. This is the Hiddish of this piece. The Hiddish is you have to make that switch. You have to make that switch. Because naturally, where you're born is only yourself. If you don't make that switch, you can live to 120 only yourself. And you call poor. Poor. You have a poor. A moment you make that decision to be. For others, you call rich. That switch to be poor or rich, that's the decision. If you want to be poor in mitzvahs, be only for yourself. You can live that way. We be poor. We want to make the decision to be rich. That's so what you have to do. Make that decision. Your eye, you have to take away your eye out. And for others. And for others. Others. And, and this is a step of marriage, a cloudy soil, being a shishiva, helping the everything. That switch and changing, this is today the success of the day in Shiva. If you do that, you'll be successful to get married, successful to have cloudy soil, you'll be successful. That's what you have to do. And you think it's a joke, it's not a joke. I was sitting one time in Kwasaba and, uh, and the, main, the main synagogue in Kwasaba, my father was sitting here, the chief rabbi was sitting, sitting near him, a big, big time of never was married, almost 90. No, sir. Never married, he says to me, you know why? Himself. To be yourself. You have to make that decision. You make that decision, everything changed. Other people, you come new. You come new, all the teva, all the nature will change for you. And the world could change like a, like a blink of an eye. Quick and fast. That little change. That you have to make a decision. And this is 
Sabe me cair nos dedos. Does it? Against the society of the world. You think you're freier than the others. You think you're not for yourself. And everything, all that you have, all these bad, negative words in the world that knocks you out. Be only yourself. But the moment you make that quick decision, like I said, from I better, all the people, you make that at some. That's a decision. This is you come to be at a, a money, and you're able to be you come to be what? A leader and what that works. That's what you need to say. And what is the big kiddush here? This is the way of a kiddush who wants it to live that way. And the rai is from Hashem. And the rai is from the Chachami. For the Rama, it's what he put the Rai in Kiddushi. The Gmon Kiddushi. Rabbi Gamiel, they brought the Kiddushi in the middle. Arbeya, you see the small lines there? It is like, like the three lines, four lines from the top. Arbeya Viach. You see Arbeya Viach, Loi, that's more Loi. You have it? Yeah. Everybody has it? Obu Chazan, the Gmon Kiddushi in Amit Beis. Rav Gamil was the Nasi in Am Yisrael. The Nasi. Like he gave example, like Moron of Chaim Kanias. The Nasi. Like Rav Shach. Like Rav Yitzchai. But big tzaddiki. And the Shammai, the thing they say is, the big tzaddiki. They have a special suda, special suda. What Rabbi Gamil does, he doesn't eat. What he does, he serves everybody to eat. What? Abhaim Kanyeski is giving everybody food. He's giving to Yosef and Avram and Dobby. He's giving you food. He's giving you a cup of tea. He's giving you a cup of tea to people. He's giving to Ruben, Shimon, Leia. He's giving everybody food. To Yaakov, Abraham Kineski, he goes, he gives you a cup, gives you water, gives you the Coca Cola, gives you the uh, chicken, fish, the meat. What is it? How does why is that? Because the I is from Avraham Avinu, because Avraham Avinu also did the same way. Also, it was a standing of Mishamash. And you also, because what is it? You live in Kvot Shamayim and you give a cup of boss of a dog? We don't understand that this. This is the way of Hashem. It's to think for others. To give to others. Not for yourself. It's to give, to think how the other person, what he needs, what he, what he needs, take care of other people, to chesed. Thinking how to do chesed for the other person. This is a sh oh, the mivole. You make yourself a new person. Why is the new person see other people what they can do? Why what, what you put a life from Rivka? Rivka. She was three years old. Three years old. She sees Eliezer coming. She says, "Listen, I will give to you to drink, and I'll give the drink to who? The horses." You know, a camel. You know how much a camel drinks? A camel. And she says, I will give you and also the camel. You know what that means? How much? She thought, this is nothing. Because you know, so when you, you think, if your goal is to help others, how much you help more, you grow more. Again, how much you help more, you grow more, not less. She had now a new opportunity to give Eliezer. And to give who? All the Gmalin. She had 10 Gmalin there. You know, it's 10 Gmalin to feed water for 10 Gmalin? She gave not one Gmalin, 10 Gmalin. But for her, it was a new opportunity for others. They give other people a new changing in our mind, a new Chidush in our mind. Is what? Thinking 
changing our attitude. You come Jewish, you come Jewish, you have to think for others. Think on how to help other people. Pain, feel other people's pain, feel other people's feeling. Think on other people what they need. For other people. Was this boy in Yeshiva? Was big Rosh Yeshiva? Couple years ago, came to Khan Kanias to to have Shema, and he said to him, "I want to find this boy in Yeshiva. He's not learning. Not in learning. He's above not learning Torah." So he asked him, "Abraham Shema asked him, tell me what is his mother's name?" He says, "I don't know." He says, "Get out of here! I don't want to come here." If, if he didn't dab him, why didn't dab him? If he didn't dab him before wow. he threw him out, wow. he didn't know his mother's name. Wow. It means you're not ready to throw a boy out of him. Wow. It means you don't care about him. Wow. You care about him by yourself. Get out of here. He didn't want to accept him. Wow. Wow. This is our thing. We have to think. They came to the Chofetz Chaim. A boy named Shiva had epilepsy. And they came to Chavetz Chaim, Chavetz Chaim said, listen, I need, a, I'm not feeling good. I'm. She said, let's go to this rabbi, and he will dump you. And then, and he got healthy. Kids, he wouldn't tell himself. And then when he got so older, he what? said, kids, I'll dump for you. Chavetz Chaim said, I fasted 40 days for you. They make sure you don't have no epilepsy. Chavetz Chaim. Others, thinking for others. I have here Azazi, my wife's great great grandfather, whose name is Nochu Mishadik. He lived here, he's buried here in Amaluchu, Azazi. He fasted for 40 years. 40 years he fasted. He only ate in the night. 40 years. I have this investment. When a person feels the pain of Amisro, feels the pain of Claudisro, feels the pain, yeah, he can fast. It's a different world. When you sell, I cannot fast. When you feel it's a bigger picture, Claudisro, Akashboku, the world, a different world. It comes a different definition. It comes different. You're living for others. You're living to give. You're living to give others and more and everybody to give. You enjoy to give people. You have pleasure to give people. You have pleasure to help. But don't make a mistake. If you give all day, you know, if you don't, you have to, if you don't have yourself, you cannot give. You have come to the yeshiva, you have to learn day and night to be able to give others. Because if you don't fill up your own, you're able to give others. If you don't know, if you don't know, if you, uh, you, you only learn yourself, if you don't know yourself to learn, and if you don't know how to prepare yourself, and you don't fulfill yourself, then how will you give? You'll give nothing. So first, you have to develop yourself, not because it's self. Yourself is for others, but you're teaching yourself. They're able to teach others. And then, but not yourself, yourself. Not yourself, yourself, and yourself, yourself. You have to do yourself for others. Yourself for others. Yourself for others. You need yourself. Because without yourself, you then do nothing. But yourself for others. This is the self we can hit. What do you say? What do you say, Samuel? No, I just wanted to say. Yes. With Rivka, you see, the Raya is to her chesed, she was zaykhed to marry. <laughs> He's that. That's a riot from what you were saying, Rabbi Shlomo. Yes. A guy who gets comes out of that selfishness and gives a single guy to find his shit. Is that the end of the riot? Exactly. Is that the end When Am Yisrael is going out of Egypt. What Moshe Rabbeinu does? 
פעולות. ויקח מוישס עצמו יוסף. מוישה טוק וואט? says the midrash, חוכם לב ייקח מצוות. It doesn't say Yosef, Moshe Abbey had to take the bones, but Moshe Abbey knew the bones. It says the midrash, he thought and he grabbed the mitzvah. I have opportunity to grab to do a mitzvah. This is the midrash said, my father said, I'm going to explain it. No, Moshe doesn't say in the Torah, Moshe Abbey had to take the bones. Yosef came in, I'm going to take it out. But Moshe Abbey grabbed the mitzvah. Thinking, he didn't think about myself. I'm leaving Egypt. I'm thinking about myself. I did take my bags and my coat and my this. I'm thinking about a mitzvah. How I can grab a mitzvah. They're able to go out in Egypt with another mitzvah. That was that he grabbed a mitzvah before he goes out of Egypt. You have the person to think. So I heard from my father, Zechel Tov, he says, everyone has to be Chacham Lev Yikach Mitzvah. Always you have to think, how you can grab another mitzvah, another mitzvah, and no one thinks about it. Grab a mitzvah. How you can grab a mitzvah, grab a mitzvah. When you think about others, and think, you always say, think, maybe this guy didn't share. My father says something, the guy brings cups, drinks. Only think of yourself, think of others. He being salt, give everybody salt. Give a plate, give everybody plates. He being bread, give everybody. Don't think about yourself. Think of any problem needs. You're already doing something, being for everybody. You being a siddur from the hair. Give everybody siddur. Why only yourself think you need a siddur? A mincha, a mighty, a shahis. Think all needs a siddur. Other people need a siddur. Think, start to train yourself thinking for others. What other people need, other people need. This is Chacham Leiv. Use your heart and be a Chacham Leiv. And this is the Mafteya, the key. Other people, what? Thinking about others. And that helps a person to get married when he is able to think others. Now they said, think about others. And doesn't say in the Torah to do it. Use your say. It doesn't say, the guy says to me, where is the Shukhan of this? Where is the Shukhan of this? It's not the Shukhan of the heart. The heart tells that. The heart says I have to do this mitzvah. The heart says it's to do it. The heart says to do this. No, he didn't have to be selfish. No, he didn't have to be selfish. He came late. He said, I said like this, I'll go back for one second. Listen, 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 I'll tell you one second. Yeah, it says, oh, A person is born like a mule. All the people says. So you're born with Teva only for yourself. We have to make yourself all the people. You it's like a new person. It's what? With Chesed. Think about this. But Teva really is what? You're born for yourself. We have to make yourself a new person. All the people is what? We think of others. Think about high, live for others. Think that is our void of to make yourself a new person. But ever you're born that way, you have to change yourself, make yourself thinking, are able to the go those ways of Hashem. This is the ways of Hashem is what? How to be toy you make it, to be good and help people. Be good and help me, other people make do good. Smile to people. Say good morning, good afternoon, good night. Give. Give a good smile, good a good shalom aleichem. Give a good feeling to people. Be glad of yourself. Good Shabbos. Good morning. Glad of yourself. Give a person what you could give. It's not only money you have to give. I cannot give money. I cannot give nothing. I'm poor. Only like a people. I'm a poor. I'm a dead person. I'm nothing. You have other things to give. You can give a smile. You give a new idea. You can help something. When you do this and that, it's not only money. Not connected to money. Who is poised in the head, not in reality. Changing yourself to get married, this is the chazal. This peace will help you to get married. This is the key. This is the sabula to get married is chesed. Thinking, you do this, 
you get the Seat of Dishmaya. I should open all the Sharim, all the gates. Perek Shiro. Shiro is what? I heard this from David Chatzira. Shiriye Shefa Rocho. No, no, no. I don't know. I don't know. But we all Shefa will come. Without the Shem, you open it. You open it what? When you do what you do, think about others. Sat in the When you do that step, Hashem will help us out to go Mikhail Chai. Skadevi, Skadevi, Shmei Rabo. Bohol, the Bohu, Sayyid, Abi, Bohu, Sayyid.